everyone, my name is Python GB and welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft Let's Play! When we left off, we created this excellent looking border around the entire island and off camera what I've done is I've actually replaced all of the blocks that weren't dirt with dirt. So for example, if we had sand under here, I got rid of it and I replaced it with dirt so it looked just a little bit better. And I've also done a little bit of uh, terrain fixing. Now, some of you more eagle-eyed viewers who also have a good memory may remember that there was a floating tree here. And this is in fact the floating tree. So if I just break this really quick, as you can see, the underground pond is still there, but it is lit up. So no mobs will be able to spawn under there. So I did that purely because I wanted the terrain to look really nice. And there was another pond right here which is why there's kind of a lack of grass in this specific part so basically where there's a lack of grass and flowers is where there was an underground pond so uh, you know it's uh, it's pretty nice right there I just wanted to make the terrain look nice for my uh, epic surroundings for my little village and the majority of you guys were saying that I should go ahead and turn this island into a fishing shack. Now, you may remember that this was actually a lot closer to this island. And uh, there's a very good reason why I made it slightly further away. A, because I want to have a little bridge going over to it. So, you know, we can just go ahead and sail under it with our old boat if we really want to. And also, eventually, I want to start on a massive pro uh project what well, will be a massive project and that is i will be making a layer of glass underneath this water basically surrounding this entire sort of ring of island right here so it's going to require a butt ton of class and well just in case you guys don't really know what i'm saying you'll find out pretty soon that so yeah yeah, that's all good right there. So, this island, I've gone ahead and uh, worked on it a little bit. As you can see, it's all made out of dirt. There's no sort of conflicting materials. There's no trees or any or any life, to be honest, on there. So, yeah, it's a perfect 7x7 seven seven square. So, just for once, we're going to be making a square building, which is not something I do very often. I normally do sort of rounded buildings and such, so that is all good. I'll tell you what, while we're doing this, I am going to do a little bit of smelting. As you can see, I've got a little bit of iron right here. Okay, so one bit of coal in there and another bit of coal in there. And we're going to grab a bit of wood to put in here because one bit of coal does eight items. So, you know, a little bit of wood would never hurt just to get the last one done. Uh, have we got any other kind of building materials we can use? Hmm. Okay, we've got some cobble. I'll tell you what, we're going to smelt a stack of glass right here right now because I think that'd be a good idea, right? There we go. So all of this and a stack of sand is going in there as we speak. So that is fantastic. Right, okay. It is about to become night time. Great! Ha! Yay! I love it when it becomes night time. Let me tell you. Right, okay. Let us try and come up with some designs. I will try to do this on camera, but if I manage to... Uh, get boring during the process then I will of course go ahead and skip ahead or fast forward a little bit so don't worry I'm trying my best I'm trying my best yeah that's right I speak like that apparently <laughs> I am trying my best ladies and gentlemen I want to get this thing nice and cool I guess right here we go Right, let's try and figure out how we want to do this. So, the entrance is going to be here, so the bridge is going to go sort of across here and over to the main island over there. So, that's going to be great. So, we've got a nice view of the forest right here. Uh, hmm. So that's, not, that's not as nice a view as that is. Or, uh, actually, no, over here looks pretty nice. Hmm. We could have, like, three fishing platforms right here. Oh my god, that sounds like an excellent idea. So much so, I'm going to steal my own idea and use it. There we go. Right, so we're going to make three fishing platforms out of this house. It's going to be good. Yeah, buddy. Right, okay. So I'm done figuring things out. There we go. And we're going to get straight on with trying to figure out exactly how we're going to do this thing. Right, okay. Okay, so it's going to go like that. It's going to go like that. And that is going to be... So entrance. No, fishing area, fishing area, fishing area, and entrance. So let's just mark that right there. Okay, so you look, we're making plays, we're getting things done, it's all good, there we go. And I guess while we're doing this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump into the question of the video, which for today comes from a user by the name of Alec Nellemans, and it is, what would you like to have added in Minecraft the most? And he stated that this could be a mod that already exists, or anything like that. So, in my opinion, if they could add basically the stuff out of the bibliocraft mod i absolutely love and adore the bibliocraft mod it really is good it doesn't affect vanilla too much it just adds a very very nice selection of uh 
of sort of decorative items. So, so you can get like item frames, no not item frames, item cases. Uh, what else can you get? You can get armor stands and potion shelves and such and regular shelves. And in my opinion, it's, it's very nice. It's a very nice mod and I do wish that they would add it into vanilla because I think it would be a very, very fitting addition to it. Yes. So I'm going to pass that question on to you guys for the question of the video today. So if you were to add a, well, anything to Minecraft, what would it be? And again, it can be from a mod or it could be something from your own imagination. <laughs> Leave your responses in the comments area below and we'll see what kind of things people come up with. Right, okay, what's going on over here? Hello, Mr. Zombie. How are you doing, buddy? Right, I don't think, I don't think I'm going to get too bombarded in the night, so I should be okay to do a bit of night building right here. Right, okay, so let's just try and figure this out once again. So let's just turn that into that. So there we go. Right, okay, and let's try and come up with some designs for the little fishing platforms. So boom, 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 boom. Okay, I'm liking this, liking this a lot. Okay, and let's have that there. It's like so. There we go. Same over here. Oh my god, it's gonna look cool. Don't worry your faces, people. I want to make this look good for you. Right, okay. Here we go. Here we here we go. Let's let's go. We're gonna get some things done. Right. Alrighty guys, apologies about that random cut. A couple of things happened. Uh I kind of got interrupted while recording, and also it got incredibly hot inside my room. So uh if you notice a slight whirring in the background. That's actually my uh, my fan on right now. So uh, I apologize if you can hear that, but I'll do my best in the editing to get rid of that. So as you can see, while off, I managed to work on the house a little bit more. As you can see, we've got windows. We've got sandstone right here as sort of the uh, support. So we just go inside real quick. It doesn't look too bad, does it? It actually doesn't look too bad. I think the colors blend in fairly well together. They're actually, I think I could do a better job if we use the uh, the smooth sandstone, if you get what I mean, uh, sort of the sandstone you'd normally find in a uh, desert temple, I'm pretty sure you can make them now, I just need to try and figure that out off camera. So that is all good right there. So the next thing we need to try and work on is indeed the roof, and we don't have a lot of wood left, so I am going to have to chop down some trees, and of course I will do my best to plant them down again, because obviously, I, I'm a green person, I want to keep all of the wildlife in this world and such, and I want to be a green person, and I want to be friendly to the environment, as you do. So that's all good. Alright, we don't actually need birch wood, but we're just going to get rid of it, just for the hell of it. There we go. <laughs> There's me saying I'm going to be green, and I'm just chopping things down for the hell of it. Yep, great logic there, Python. Great logic. Well done, buddy. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, okay. Please, please do give me all of this stuff. I would much, much appreciate it. There we go. Please, shut up. I'm trying to record, you stupid-ass sheep. Like, really? What is up with you guys? Right, okay. Uh, you are going to fall off. No, both of you are about to fall off because... All of these leaves, okay, all three of you are about to fall off because all of these leaves are now decaying and once the one underneath you decays then you're kind of screwed, aren't you, buddy? Yeah, you are. Don't, don't try and deny it, you stupid ass. Right, here we go. Planting some trees, making plays like you do. Right, uh, uh, another sapling, boom. All right, you can, oh, that's too close to that one, actually. All right, you can go there. Right, okay, I think we're pretty much good on the wooden front now. Right, okay. So I do want to try and get the uh, the bridge in this episode, and because I've had to record this in kind of two parts, I actually don't know how long I've been recording for, so I don't know, I might wind up overrunning, which is kind of suckish, because I want to try and stick to around 15 minutes for each of these videos, because it seems like a, a pretty, pretty sort of solid amount to go for. Right, okay. And boom, boom. And in my opinion, watching a 15 minute video is a lot easier than watching a 30 minute video, if you get what I mean. Right, okay. Or we could use slabs. We could use slabs for the roof. That seems like a legit idea. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Right, why don't I even jump down for? I was supposed to stay up there so I can get things done. Right, okay. And here we go. I'm going to make a pretty basic roof. Nothing too fancy schmancy. Okay, and like that. We're going to need a bunch more wood, actually, weren't we? Hmm. All right, we're going to try and decide what we need to... What we're going to be making the pathways out of on this on that island when we start making our village. Uh, I'm thinking gravel, because gravel actually doesn't look too bad with the sort of nice lush green grass we got going here. I reckon that would be a, a pretty sort of nice change of scenery, 
compared to using something like wood, for example. I don't know. It, it could look good. It could not look good. I don't know. We just gotta just gotta try it out. You know, test the old waters. See if we like it or not. There we go. And the reason why I'm putting half slabs at the top here is so that no hostile mobs spawn. And, well, it doesn't look too bad either. Let's be honest with you. There we go. So that's just about that done. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. I think the last thing I would like to do really quick is actually to place some upside down stairs. Just for the inside because they do not look bad at all. See you later. It's, it's looking pretty damn nice, our little fishing shack. Yeah! Now that's a pretty pimping little shack, isn't it? It's beautiful! Right, okay, what we need to try and figure out is how we're going to do the storage. Right, okay. Uh, I think I've got an idea. We could have like a chest for fishing rods, a chest for the actual fish, we could have a chest for junk, and then a chest for treasure. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I think that's a good idea. I think that is a good idea. And I'm saying that because it's my own idea. <laughs> Not that I'm tooting my own horn. <laughs> Lol. Right, there we go. Boom and boom. Yeah. Now we're pimping. Look at this. <laughs> right, okay. Right, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do a little bit of mining of the old woods off camera. And I will be back with you guys when I feel I've got enough resources to make this little bridge. So I will be back with you guys in a minute. Alrighty guys, so I've actually done a little bit of wood mining, and as you can see, I've got 16 oak wood left. I'm at, I, well, actually, I had half a stack when I first started, but as you can see, I've used a little bit because I actually raised the entrance right there, and the reason why I did that is because I would like to be able to have that sort of bridge raised sort of already, if you get what I mean. So, uh, you know, we just got to try and figure out how exactly we are going to work this bridge. Yes, so, I mean, obviously this is going to have to be a block just like that, because, you know, uh, you can't use a half slab there, like right there, or you can't get inside the door, which is, yeah, 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 I mean, you, you really can't argue with that. Okay, so let's just try and figure a little something, something out right here. Right, okay, so we've got oak stairs, like so. Okay, okay, I'm liking this so far. Right, how are we going to work this? How are we going to work this without it looking like crap? Because, of course, I don't want it to look like crap. If it looks like crap, then I'm not going to be happy. Alright, so if I do that, okay, so bring this over here, bring it over there again, okay, and I can go up, and if I just do uh, that, no, hang on, uh, yeah, if I just do this, alright, I think that's high enough for boats to get under, I'm pretty sure, without being hurt anyway, that should just about do it. There is a zombie coming over here. What a derp! Hello, sir! Oh, you're not such a derp after all, are you? You bloomin' jumped in the water to save yourself. And you're dead. And you're dead. Get now? Ooh! Yeah, thanks, buddy. He gave me an iron ingot. <laughs> and just to clarify, I actually got these two from zombies as well. And the funny thing is, one of the zombies, it was literally like within five seconds of killing each other, I got these two. It was pretty ridiculous, actually. I think I had like seven zombies in total, and a lot of them were holding stuff. And, uh, well, I just got these two, which is pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> you yeah, buddy. Right. Ah. Mm. The underside doesn't look too appealing, does it? So if I just do that, okay, so like that, and I'm pretty sure... It can start coming down again, right here. I think that should work. So we just go back over here really quick. And do that. And just as a temporary measure, do that. And, oh, wait, hang on, that's not going to work. I need to get rid of that half slab. And we go, rid of the half slab, and do this. And then, yeah, that's right, just alternate between the two so you can get back down to the... Back down to the level you need to get down to, basically. There we go. Alright, there we go. Now we're starting to make sense. <laughs> I like this already. This is a pretty high bridge, though. Maybe half slabs wasn't such a bad idea after all, right? I don't know. Right, okay, so let's just try a little bit more of this. Hmm, I'm not too good with bridge designs, especially small bridge designs. Actually, that's one of my genuine weaknesses. I can't really do them very well at all. Right. Maybe I should... Yeah. I'm, I'm thinking I should lower this. Right. Okay, I tell you what, guys, just to uh, avoid my OCD taking over and making me rage, what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip ahead just a little bit, just so we, when we got to the point where this is finished. So I'll see you guys when I am done, basically. 
Alrighty guys, so I've been working on the bridge a little bit and as you can see I've come up with a design which I think looks pretty cool. My OCD is pretty uh, pretty satisfied with this, it's pretty symmetrical which I really like and of course there's plenty enough room to get under with a boat which is what I want and it's what I need and it's beautiful, just look at it. The only thing I will say is maybe I can go ahead and put some fences on the sides here so I don't just walk off the edge but let's be honest, the only reason I'd walk off the edge is because I'm a stupid idiot. So. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Do you reckon I should go ahead and put fences right here? Or do you reckon I should leave them off just for now? Or maybe you think I should alter the design completely? I don't know. Leave your feedback in the comments area below. So, uh, yeah. And uh, just talking about the questions as well. Don't worry, guys. If your question isn't used, it's not to say that I don't like your question. It doesn't mean it's not going to be used in the future. So, don't worry your faces. <laughs> I'm not... It's not... I'm not leaving you guys out, okay? I do read every single comment that is left on my video, and I really do appreciate the feedback that you guys have been uh, giving me, whether it be a question or a like or a subscription or anything like that. I do appreciate it. So, uh, yeah. So, again, if you've got a question that you would like answered or you want me to answer, then just go ahead and put it in the comments area, and you'll have a chance of yours being used. So that is all good right there. But for now, what I'm going to do is end the episode right there, because I think we did a pretty good amount today. We've got the fishing shack done. We've got a little bridge done and probably by the start of the next episode I'm going to go ahead and clear all of the flowers from this I'm not going to destroy them I'm going to put them in a chest safely so we can go ahead and reuse them so basically once the little sort of island village is complete we could just go ahead and use the flowers for scenery we could just place them back down whether it be in a plant pot or something and it should all look good yeah, as in like really it should look pretty right pretty good you know <laughs> that's all I can see flowers look nice so yeah but yeah, I guess on that note, it is time to win the episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the episode, and of course you want to see more, be sure to hit that sub thumbs up button. And of course you can subscribe if you want to know when the future videos are out. But for now, it is time for me to go. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for your con continued support again. Sorry, I am messing up my outro real bad here. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.